here I was thinking outside wouldn't work instead I've got heavenly lights. BZ here with a biz tip for you. I don't care what business you're in, it is either your slow season or your busy season coming up. And you have no excuses because you know this is about to happen. So a few things you can do, obviously, schedule out the next three months of your life. And I say life because your business should be supporting your life, right? So look at a calendar. I take blank pieces of paper and I write four lines down and then six lines down them <laughs> and I figure out what's going on the calendar. I put in the holidays, I put in the birthdays, I put in the off days and go from there. You might be taking some holidays. We've got a few coming up. Once you do that, put in the events. So again, life events, business events, um, anything, especially in business, you might be having a holiday party. You might be having sales. You might be having inventory days. Um, you might be having stocking days. It really kind of depends on the seasonality of your business. You might be shutting down entirely. Put those in your calendar, start blocking things out. And here's the, the crucial component of this is double check your capacity. I can't tell you how many times I work with people who plan big things in their business and they completely forget that they've got kids, the holiday performances coming up or end of season games and award ceremonies or you know their families coming to visit and they just don't confirm that they have the capacity to pull off the shit in their business that they're trying to. So. Make sure that whatever it is you're planning and whatever it is you are scheduling in order to keep your business flowing beautifully and simply and easily through your busy or slow season, that you are also making sure you've got the capacity to pull it all off. Now, once you've got your schedule and your capacity confirmed, it's time to put the systems in place to make sure that you can pull it all off, right? So what needs to be automated? What needs to be scheduled? What needs to be batched? What needs to be created in advance so that you're taking advantage of the busy season or what needs to be planned in advance so that you know you've got cash flow during your slow season? That's how you game your productivity, my friends.